Okay, we're live. Hello, my lovelies. How are you? I feel like I need some like little background music or something because I've got my AirPods in and I can hear, but I can't quite hear. So anyway, hello, hello. So have an update for Bella. She had her kittens yesterday. Yay! I was gonna come into the quilt shop yesterday and sent a message to Lana. I was like, sorry, not gonna make it. Uh, we have baby kitten and I need to make sure that they all survive and that my kitty survives and everything is all good. So babies are good. Four little babies. We have calico and a dark one and some gray and white ones. I think I'll probably bring them in in two weeks. So that'll be July 14th. Wendy's here. Hi, Wendy. How are you? So we'll have uh, kitten love, lots of kitten love on um, July 14th. So that'll be fun. Behind me you see the prim and proper quilt. This one is one of the ones that we had on the Spokane Quilt Show. Let's see if you can see the see the quilt. Yep, it's gorgeous. Um, that one was by Cora Gwynn from Spokane. She did a really nice job. Just in case you want a quilt kit, we have kits. And for those of you that wanted some Lori Holt goodies, we do have a couple of Lori Holt goodies. Not a whole lot of Lori Holt goodies, but we've got a couple. Um, let's see. And then we have a really fun game we're gonna to play today um, for the giveaway. So I'm gonna give you the first part of a sentence and then you have to finish the sentence and just participate. If you get it right or if you get it wrong, it doesn't matter. Um, it'll be fun, but then you'll get entered in for the drawing. So let me give you an example here. Actually, I'll wait for a couple of minutes till we have a couple more people hop on because we just got started. So today I'm gonna to show you a whole bunch of the new stuff that we got in. Um, we have something special. Karen says I'm here and as excited as always. <coughs> oh, Karen, thanks for being here. Okay, so last week, I believe it was Tammy number two who was asking about something that was chicken and cross stitch. So first is Tammy number two here. I haven't seen her yet. Okay, so Tammy number two, when you're here, let us know that you're here. Remember that there's a little bit of a delay here. I have a chicken cross stitch just for you. <laughs> so this is our little chicken project that we have. This is uh, Lanart is the brand. And this one is done on linen, it looks like. And we actually have just one. So somebody send a message to Tammy number two and tell her we do have a chicken cross stitch. And you could change the color if you wanted, but this looks a lot like pancake. Tammy, no, Tammy Chase is here, but I think she's Tammy number three. Yeah. Yes. So Tammy number two was here last week and she was asking about cross stitch. Ooh, just fell off my flip flops. Flip flops. Sorry about that. Anyway, so when she gets here, there's a chicken thing, chicken cross stitch. Okay, so <clears throat> we're having a huge sale this weekend. And we are announcing a new sale starting tomorrow because tomorrow is July 1. So today is the last day to get 10% off wide backs. We still have a lot of wide backs in stock. Um, so it's 10% off with coupon code wide stash. So today's the last day for that. And Michael says hello from Texas. Hi, Michael. How are you? I'm Christy with RebsFabStash.com. We're an online quilt shop. Just in case you were wondering who we are and what we're doing. I am modeling our apron that was from the stash box this last month. Actually, everybody got it, so. Oh my gosh, look who's here. What, hello, guess who just walked in? Two very special, special guests. Come on over. Hey everybody, this is my sister. Hi sister. Baby from Philadelphia. How are you? I'm good. How are hey, you? I like your t-shirt. Thanks. That's really I pretty. It up. Oh, you did? I did. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Very cool. Hi, Mom. Shall I cover up my t-shirt? No, I it's fine. Let me wear yours. So much fabric, so little time. <laughs> and the older I get, the less fun I get. <laughs> oh my gosh. So what are you guys doing? Picking out some fabric? Mm -hmm. For curtains for the... For the camper. Oh, cool. Yeah. Katie's She's got a camper too. I don't sew. Well, full disclosure, I don't sew, but I like to have things made for me. <laughs> Hi, everybody. And we'll see you soon. Yep, and Red's here. So, what are we having for dinner? Leftovers? Fish? Fish. Fish. 
fish, fish tacos. <laughs> yep, she's here from Philly. Grace says hello from Westchester, Pennsylvania. Westchester, hello, Grace. Westchester. Westchester. I know where Westchester. Probably is. Westchester. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's near me. Yeah, that's really close to Katie. Yep. I'm in Vermont. So Katie and her family are visiting this week. I was just telling them about Bella had her little kitten. Yeah, she, I looked. I peeked at Did saw, you? I saw one. Oh, look, Ed's sticking out. Yeah. <laughs> Cute babies. Cute little babies. I have pictures, but um, I can't really show you on the phone. Uh, anyway, so yeah, so we're having dinner. Dad came down today, so it's a big old party at, in our house. This is, the, yeah, this is the apron that was in yeah. the stash box. Oh my gosh. I can use one of those. Okay, too. well I might have to take one after. <laughs> you might have to take one after. I all. love that red, white, and blue. I know. Isn't that cute? It's isn't cute. cute. It's it like cute. It too. I do. Well, sad thing is I don't think we have any more fabric for I, these. You have to sign up for the stash box in I order do. to get the fabric. I only need to How do white. I sign up? That's not. The, no, you have to have the stash box. Oh, to sign up. You just go on RevsFabStash.com okay. and you go to stash box okay. and you sign up. And then we put tutorials out there every month um, so that people can have little tutorials on how to do the projects. And we have little projects. So, like we had a table runner that we did. See that little sunflower table runner? Uh -huh. We did that one. Uh -huh. It's very easy. Okay. Nice to see you all. <laughs> Check your AirPods. Check your AirPods. <laughs> I don't know. I think they just yeah, are trying to. Bye, ladies. Like have Thanks fun. Thanks for being here. Keep yeah. shopping. Yeah. We're going to go shopping and find some things to eat and make things. Okay. <laughs> Bye. 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 Thanks for being here. <laughs> okay, where was I? I forgot. Let's see. So we have new stuff. Oh, sales. We were talking about sales. So today is the last day for the um, white backs. 10% off every all of our white backs that we have in stock. Uh, we still have a lot of Lori Holt white backs too, by the way. In case you have any Lori Holt white backs that you need, we have a lot of them. Karen says, love the stash box. Awesome. Thank you, Karen. I'm glad that you like it. Um, and the reason why I'm wearing the apron today is not only because we're barbecuing tonight, but also because this was the only shirt that I could find. And it is a Red Stab Stab t-shirt, but it's dirty because I was out playing with my chickens earlier today. <laughs> so anyway, okay, what else? Uh, we have new sales starting tomorrow. We have a weekend sale starting tomorrow. Um, so let's see, so keep an eye on that. We have a stash sale this evening at five o'clock. Uh, I might even announce it a little bit early because I do want to hurry up and get home and um, do more barbecue stuff. Um, and it is a Lori Holt item, so stick around. The email will be going out at 5.15 tonight, so you guys get a head start on that. Um, and if the AirPods aren't working, then I'm just going to keep talking loud so that the phone picks it up and the AirPods and whatever will get it figured out. Okay, so anything else? Was there anything else that we were going to cover? Mm -hmm. Okay, so the game. So let's go over the game. Here's what we're doing for our giveaway game. So I'm gonna give you a part of a sentence and then you have to guess the last part of the sentence. Okay, and then just guess and you'll get entered in. Um, our giveaway items are Lori Holt stuff, Lori Holt goodies. So that's always fun. Okay, so what do we have? So here's my example. Um, quilts are like friends. And then there's more to the sentence. So then your guess would be, what's the rest of the sentence? In this case, the, uh, the rest of the sentence is a great source of comfort. Aww, how cute. Okay, so, so that's the example. So I'm gonna give you the first part of the sentence, you guess the last part of the sentence, ready? Okay, so here's the first one. Quilt until, quilt until, what's the rest of the sentence? Okay, throw some guesses out there. Quilt until, finish the sentence. Okay, that's our giveaway. <coughs> Ooh, sorry. Okay, we had a ton of new stuff coming this week, which is great because I was not here, so they had to get it all in and listed. So that's fun. Is Tammy number two here yet? All right, Tammy number two, if you're here, let us know. I've got something special just for you. Denise says, have fun with the family. Thank you. I will. I have been. Um, they're going to be here until next Wednesday, so... Very much looking forward to that. Her and her husband are here and her three boys. And so far, we haven't had too much too much drama with the kiddos. But um, anyway, but boys are having a lot of fun going out and helping me find eggs. They're like, wow, they're all different colors. And I'm like, uh-huh. And they're like, it's like an Easter egg hunt every day. And I'm like, yep, yep, yep. Okay, so a lot of this stuff I haven't even seen. So let's see what we have here. This is called Seize the Day, as in S-E-A-S. -S. Let me put this over here so we can find it again. This is a half yard bundle. There are five
five half yards and one panel. And for those of you that are just joining us, our giveaway is Lori Holt items. Our stash sale is Lori Holt stuff. And don't forget about our wide back sale, 10% off everything we have in stock. I have lots of Lori Holt wide backs in stock. They are on sale. Okay, so seize the day, S-E-A-S -E today. So hang on, let me take a look here, make sure I've got it right side up. So here's a panel, and I'm showing you the half yard bundle. We do probably also have these in back quarter bundles. That's cute, very bright. Let's see, this is by, hold on, PB Textiles. Seize the day by Bethany Joy, well for three wishes fabric. That's cool. And then I believe, yes, I have a kit to show you as well for this. Cute, 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 cute. This would make fun little trivets, little wall hanging, little matching posters, cute. And then let's look and see what else we have in the collection. Wow, this is cute. This is really cute. Okay, we have Turtles and hearts and a boat and rainbows. Cute. Seize the day. Fun, fun, fun. And we have, ooh, this is cool. Look at this. A really bright ocean waves. Okay, so for those of you that are just joining, the giveaway is we're going to do a sentence. I'm going to say the first part of the sentence and you say the last part of the sentence. And it all has to do with quilting. So quilt until... Finish the sentence. Quilt until, this is pretty. So this wave has some green and orange, dark blues, light blues, aquas, teals. Pretty. Then we have another cute turtle print. Cute, cute, lots of color in here. I know I'm saying cute again. Turtles, greens and aquas and purples. Very pretty. Then we have, Annette said, I did a quilt with Three Wishes Unicorn Utopia fabric. Ooh, that was pretty. I think we might have had that. I think we're out of it now. But that is really, that was a pretty collection. Palm trees, nice. You don't often see palm tree fabric. I don't anyway. Let's see, and then here we have sunshine, clouds. That's really pretty, peeking out from behind the clouds. Very cool. That likes corsets. Okay. Then we have a kit with the fabric. So here is the kit. This finishes 42 and a half by 42 and a half. So nice throw size. In case you know somebody who has a beach house and they need something small. There you go. Of course, the picture doesn't do it justice, but you use the panel and then build some blocks around it. This looks like this would be really good for a beginner quilter. Um, we've got all the fabric in here, including the binding. Put that over here. So we saw the panel and we saw all of the other fabrics in the collection. The only other thing we didn't see was the white on white that we did. And it's a little white on white circles, circle dots. But very fun, very easy quilt to make. Awesome. Love it, love it. Here's the panel again. And the C fabric. Grace says, I like your apron. Do you have the pattern? Why, Grace, as a matter of fact, it's a free pattern that you can download on, I need to find out what the, where the pattern is. Cause I can't remember. It's three Wishes. Three Wishes. Funny Farm. Welcome to the Funny Welcome Farm. To, Welcome to the Funny Farm collection. They made an apron out of it. And so this is the apron that we had in our stash box. Um, we have a tutorial on our website of some of the changes that, um, that she made when she was putting this together. Just, um, she added some pockets, she added a lining, and then she did her pockets a little bit differently so that they came out a little bit bigger. So it's a free download on the Three Wishes Fabric website. Uh, you go and look for um, the funny farm apron pattern and then watch our tutorial which is on our website and then you can see what the changes are that we made to the to the apron to just give it a little bit more of a nice finish so 
there you go. But it was this was one of the projects in our stash box. In case you haven't heard of our stash box, it is a monthly subscription box that we have with projects, little small projects. So we have a little block that we do, and then we have other small projects that we've done, an apron, we've done scissor holders, um, we've done little table runners, wall hangings, we've made pillows, we've done all kinds of fun things. So just go on our website and look for Stash Box, and you get a new one every month with fun new projects, and we put presents in there, um, we have Stash little goodies, and we like to just throw surprises in there, so it's a lot of fun. We have a lot of fun putting them together, and we have a lot of fun coming up with projects. And then if you go on our RevsFab Stashers page, you'll see some of the projects that we've done uh, previously, and that's a Facebook group that we have on our RevsFab Stash Facebook group. RevsFab Stashers. Yes. That was a mouthful. Okay, I have to take a breath for a second. Um, okay, so the next one is Dockside. Uh, this is a fat quarter bundle, and I apologize that I am saying um so much, but I literally just ran in here like a couple minutes ago. I had a little plumbing issue with my camper that I had to fix today, and as it usually goes, I ran in and out of town six times today. The part wasn't right, I didn't have the right part, then I had to go back, and then I had to get a different part, and then I had to get a different machine, and then I had to get a different tool, and then oh my gosh. And then it was like, okay, I gotta go. I've got my life. Okay, this is called Dockside by Henry Glass. And this is by Barb. So here we've got a panel. This is a 23 and a half inch panel, 24 inch panel. And Henry Glass is really good about always putting free patterns on their website. So I believe we have kit yes we have a kit for this as well that I will show you but this that I'm showing you is the fat quarter bundle and it has 11 fat quarters plus the panel so lots of fun things you can do with this wow this is cute I haven't seen this sorry I haven't seen this at all so this is called Dockside by Henry Glass so here we have kind of an all-over print in a lake dogs Ducks, geese, Canada geese, all the things that we would see on the lake. Dock Lodge. Ooh, we've got some bass on here. Fishing. This is a really good thing you could use for somebody who likes the outdoors and likes their lake. Dock Lodge, bait, fishing, ducks, feathers. Okay, then we have, ooh, we've got some lily pads in here. Pretty cute. Little pink flowers. How does that look? Uh -huh. Then we have some oars floating in the water. I don't see the boat anywhere nearby, so hopefully whoever was in the boat can get back to shore. And then we have a Henry Glass folio print. This is the green tonal, tone on tone. Here we have canoes printed on the bias. This would make a great binding. Very cool. Boating, fishing, beach, nap, sunsets, relax, splash. And then we have some geese. Wow, that's cool. Ah. Again, prints you don't normally tend to see. And those look to be Canada geese to me. Karen, can you confirm? <laughs> Looks like they're Canada geese to me. And then we have some dragonflies, because you always have dragonflies at the lake. This is a cool bundle. Adirondack chairs on bed. And a red folio. So a lot of options here that we can do with that. Cute little fat quarter bundle. We don't have a lot of that collection and then let's see this is the kit so this is a free project on the Henry Glass website so maybe you have a panel and a fat quarter bundle or something that you're not sure what you're going to do with it great place to look is on the websites for free patterns this one happens to be a Henry Glass and I like this because there's a little bit 
of a challenge here with putting the this border together. It's not just the straight strips all around. This one was designed by Heidi Pridemore with Whimsical Workshop. She does a really nice job with panels. She does free patterns for probably just about every fabric manufacturer. Most of them have um, <clears throat> free patterns on their website. Oh, that's cool. And then they use the Adirondack chairs for the border out here, this outer border. That's cool, I like that. This one finishes, let's see, it says on here, 54 by 66. So put that one over here. See if we have any different fabric in here than what we had in the bundle. We have the panel. Let me just take another look at that. I like this panel. I keep telling my husband I need to get some Adirondack chairs because they're heavy enough, they won't blow away. <laughs> We have that problem with our deck furniture. Got it on the back, it gets windy and they blow away. New Adirondack chair, Canada geese flying by, a little mountain in the background. Cool, I like that, that's a nice panel. And then we have, let's see, we have a folio, green, and the Canada geese print again. Lily pads, the oars, uh, the dragonflies. Ooh, this border print. We haven't seen this border print yet. Okay, so this is interesting. Karen says, yes to the Canada geese, and they bite you when they're nesting. Okay, good to know. I will not go near any Canada geese when they're nesting. We get them coming through here, too. So this is cool. Looks like on the pattern. Hang on, let me look. Hang on. Oh, yeah. So use different parts of this border print for the uh, for the borders. So there's one spot on the quilt where you use this strip here with the canoes and the dogs, and then there's another section where you use these Adirondack chairs. So that is cool. Good usage of that print. And then you have a little bit of extra, so if you want to make a little placemat or something, you can do that. All right, what else do we have? Ooh, let's see. We have Lavender Garden. This one is also by Henry Glass. So this is a back quarter bundle. And there are 10 back quarters and two panels in this collection, in this little back quarter bundle. This is cool. So we have Lavender. And I can't remember what this little blue star flower is doesn't say on here. These are cute, look at these cute little blocks. This one also has a free pattern on the Henry Glass website. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And then we have very lush, thick lavender and leaves and have some little heart shapes too. Kind of a viney print and then more of these little blue flowers. Who knows what these blue flowers are? Oh, did we have some guesses? Let's do a guess. Um, we'll do a giveaway for the sentence. Hang on, I'll finish showing this first. Lavender butterflies. Ooh, pretty. Purple butterflies, light blue background, green, viney print. Can you see that viney print? And then we have purple butterflies or moths, maybe, on a light green. Oh, that's cool. That's a wicker print, like a wicker chair. Cool. And then lavender. This looks like the chai flower to me, but I don't know for sure what that is. And then let's look at the panels. Let's see. Okay. Stitched with love, made with love, stitched with love. That's cool. This panel has these little labels on the bottom. Cool. You see that okay? All right. And then here's another panel that we have here. Let's see how this one goes. Block panel. 
lots of different size blocks. Got a book over here, some dried flowers on the inside. A little cup of tea. Pretty pretty. Fiona Columbine flowers, I think. Yes? Columbines. You might be right. Kind of, yeah. They might be Columbine. That's hard to say. Good idea. Okay, so let's see. We were going to quilt until you get distracted and start another project. That's yes, yeah, that's how what I do. Our, our one that we were coming up with though was a quilt until you run out of stash and cash. <laughs> The rooster crows. The rooster crows at three o'clock in the morning at my house. <laughs> That's the one part that I think Katie and Paul aren't liking as much. The one that we had was quilt until you wilt. So that's good. Those are good guesses. We like those. Okay, so let's do a drawing and see what we're gonna give away. Rebecca Welsh. Rebecca, are you here? So with our giveaways, you have to be present when. And then we give you options. So Rebecca, let us know if you're here. And if you are, I will let you pick what you would like. Okay, so for our next one, our next question, our next sentence, itching to be, finish the sentence. Itching to be, okay, Rebecca's here. Would you like, let's see, we have, um, sometimes they send me little samples of fabric. This one is Venner Text Bird Song by Pat Sloan. These are little five inch squares and the little Be Organized labels by Lori Holt. Or, Rebecca, you can get one of the planners, 2022 Be In My Bonnet Planner by Lori Holt. And it comes in a nice box, really nice planner. Make sure you get your water in every day or you can have a little uh, buttons button jar. So Rebecca, let us know which one you would like. Button jars or the planner or the little five inch squares from the Pat Sloan fabric. Okay, next question. Yes, did you need? You got that one. Okay. I almost said it. Oh, kit. That's what I was looking for. So for that lavender garden fabric that I just showed you, Again, like I said, there's a free pattern on the Henry Glass website. You can check this out. Um, usually by searching the fabric collection, you can find these patterns. Um, this is called Lavender Garden Kit by Jane. And it uses that panel, has some little star blocks, and puts it all together. And I think all the fabrics in here we've seen Except for the white around the stars, we made a substitute of this white on white. It's a scatter dot. It's almost like a snow snowflake dot. Can you see that? Here we go. So different size circles. I don't think you can see that very well. Let me turn it back up, see if that works. Okay. So we have that kit. All the rest of the fabrics we saw. We'll have to go read about that. We've got channels, butterflies. Okay. So we have that kit for the lavender one. That one, oh, by the way, that one finishes 78 by 84. And uh, it does also have the binding. And this quilt was designed by Heidi Pridemore. See, I told you, I don't think she ever sleeps. I just don't. What else do we have that's new? Steam in the spring. This is a half yard bundle. There are five pieces in it and two panels. Steam in the spring. Okay. And like I said, I haven't been here much this week, so I have not seen very much of this fabric. Okay. This is a train or railroad themed fabric. Let's see, who's it by? Um, Steam in the Spring by Michael Shelton for Three Wishes Fabric. Oh, wow. Cool. Steam engines. Those are 
cool. This is a nice uh, panel size for pillows. Lots of bright colors. Can you see those? Wow, those look cool. Awesome, and this is a big panel. This is, um, let's see, this is about a one yard, maybe bigger, maybe 43 inch panel. So these are nice big pillows. That's cool. And then we have another panel in here. And let's look at this one. This has to do with trains. Who has a grandson that likes trains? Maybe not Thomas the train. Real trains. This says East Coast Railroad on this engine. It's going over that really cool old bridge. Yes. Waterfall in the background. Can you see that waterfall and the rocks? Oh, it looks maybe it's coming out of a tunnel. Oh, it is coming out of a tunnel. Cool. See, I can't look at it. I can't quite see it backwards. Cool. All right, what else do we have? In this bundle. So it's a little half yard bundle. And we have the panel up right now. If you click on the link for the panel, you can grab that. Or you can grab this half yard bundle. So here we have a whole bunch of trains going through town. Not sure which town. It says East Coast Shipping Company, East Coast Railroad. So obviously it's somewhere on the East Coast. It actually kind of reminds me of the railroads in Philly. Because I've been on those ones. I've been on lots of them actually. I'm usually asleep when I'm going very far on the train. Mountain train travel, Eastern Railroad, Vintage Railroad. It's kind of an all over print. It's not directional. And we have blueprints of a train. Okay, so for the giveaway again, itching to be, finish the sentence. Denise says my grandson would have loved that years ago. Well, maybe you'll have a great grandson pretty soon. Look at those blueprints, that's cool. Railroad engine. Here's the white that we have in the bundle. It's the little circles, white on white circles. Can you see that? And then we have the butterflies and the flowers, which has to do with the steam in the spring thing. Nice bright colors. Okay. And then we have steam into spring wall hanging. And like I said, these uh, panels are the right size for pillows as well. So this one, this wall hanging finishes 42 by 42. And basically you take those pillow panels and you cut them down a little bit into squares. That's called fussy cutting when you specifically cut it the way that you want it, which part of it you want to show. And then you frame it and you bind it and you're done. So we have these kits. As well, let's see if there's any fabric in here we haven't already seen. We've got that pillow panel. Oh, that's interesting. That larger panel's in here too. Not sure how they use that. Oh, huh. they use it for that. Oh, no, we haven't seen this one. This one is the border print in this collection. This is really pretty. Oh, wow. Look at that. It's a landscape print. The tunnels and the waterfalls. And the trees are in bloom. Let's give you a nice close up of that. Very cool. I like that. Okay, put that over here so I don't get it mixed up with the bundle. And all the rest of the fabric we already saw. We saw those panels. Okay. Yes. Next collection. Should we do a giveaway? Are we ready for a giveaway? Okay. Okay, so itching to be sewing the night away from Annette. Itching to be in the ditch. <laughs> Karen. And Fiona says, itching to be zipping. That's a good one. Uh, the one that we came up with is itching to be stitching. So that was ours. Did Rebecca say what she wanted? Planner. Okay. 
Cool. So next winner is Helen Santana. So Helen, let us know you're here. And if you are, you either get this little bundle. This is the Pat Sloan five inch squares and the Be Organized tags. Or, she's here. Okay. You get the little button jars. All right, so let us know which one you'd like, the button jars or the Pat Sloan fabric and the Be Organized tags. Okay, next giveaway. When life gives you scraps, finish the sentence. When life gives you scraps. Okay. This one is World of Wonder half yard bundle. I have not seen this. There are seven half yards and two panels in this collection and I have no idea. This one is also from Three Wishes. Apparently I went on a spree with Three Wishes fabric. All right, let's see what we've got. Two panels, let's start with the panels. You like how I'm holding the fabric and you. <laughs> All right, is Tammy Stubbs here yet? Ooh. Tammy Stubbs, where is, her? where is that girl? Oh, sideways. Is it sideways? Oh, here we go. So we have fairies and the earth, kind of mothery nature-y kind of thing. And, oh wow, that's cool. It is Mother Earth. And then down here, these fairies. This is a really big panel. I think this is another 43 inch panel, so you can make pillows out of this. This is really hard to hold when you're holding this the way I am. Try not to laugh at me too much. What do we have here? We have Mother Nature. And then over here, we have. trees and balloons and stuff. <laughs> okay, where did that one go? This one is a panel of, of, oh wow, that's gorgeous. We've got the ocean, desert, must be a Mother Earth kind of a thing. really pretty. Wow. I'm kind of speechless. Can you tell? I'm like, it's not cute. Uh, it's just really pretty. All right, so we have unicorns and lions and stuff out in the wild. Yep, definitely a unicorn and a lion. I don't know about the unicorns and realistic, but whatever, they're there. And moth, butterfly, wings. That's really pretty. And then we have the lion's print. Okay. And then we have unicorns. Kind of all over, kind of packed in unicorn. And then we have, what is this? What is this? World of Wonder by Joseph Newall. World of Wonder. Swirly rainbows. And, wow, this is cool. Little hummingbirds in these little bubbles. Earth, antlers, uh, boats, unicorns, kind of a sea print, and this is just a very interesting multicolored nocturnal. <laughs> I don't know if that's the wind <clears throat> or what. And then I think we have a kit with that one too. Yes, we do. <clears throat> World of Wonder Quilt. All right. So this uses that large.
large panel. This finishes 46 and a half by 54 and a half. And has the panel in the middle there. Okay, little stars. That's kind of a cool way to frame the panel. I like what they did there. Any different fabric in that kit? No, I don't think so. Okay, then we have more cute things. What is this cute? Forest Friends for the Boy. Cute little bundle. Okay, so the giveaway question, when life gives you scraps, finish the sentence. Wendy says, all quiet behind the cameras. Are you okay? <laughs> Tammy number one is not in here. She <laughs> is actually packing stash boxes right now. So if you want to get in on this stash box game, um, you have until midnight tonight, actually till 9 p.m. tonight, to get in for the next one. <clears throat> Little surprises, I was actually walking through some of the projects and all the things that we've got in the box, and I was going, oh cute, oh cute, oh my gosh, this is so cute, oh cute. It's going to be stuffed full. All right, so for the giveaway, when life gives you scraps, make a scrap quilt. Of course, that one's from Betsy. <coughs> yep. When life gives you scraps, make a frozen margarita. Hey, Wendy. <laughs> when I'm coming to North Carolina next, I'm going to come see you. <laughs> Lynn says, I made a table runner from the June box today. Good. How did that go, Lynn? Were you really happy with how it came out? She said... She loves it. Good. I know. Isn't that cute? Um, I actually have the table runner right over here. So I should show you that. All right. Let's do a giveaway. So when life gives you scraps, uh, the one that we had was you make a quilt. So <laughs> I liked your answers. Very good. That was fun. Okay. Next. So Annette. Hey, Annette Dombrowski. You are the next winner. We are going to be giving you a little... Be organized button jars. We will get those out to you shortly. Cheryl, we've already taken those out of inventory, so we're good on that. Um, let's see, let's do one more just for fun. The, ha, this one's my favorite. A messy house is a sign, finish the sentence. A messy house is a sign Give me your answers. Messy house is a sign. This is gonna be my favorite. I can't wait to read you guys this. Responses. Okay, so let me see, what am I doing here? This is Forest Friends by Audrey Jean Roberts for Three Wishes Fabric. And we have this little bundle. Hang on, I lost my card already. This one is a little five uh, cat quarters and a panel. So we have this little block panel, which I believe is upside down. Let me make it not upside down so I can read it. Wild little bear, quiet little owl, adventure hedgehog, curious little raccoon, um, quiet little owl, ooh, adventurous hedgehog, that's cute. Those little squares. So we have a little boy version and a girl version with this fabric. I think this is our half yard bundle. <laughs> A messy house is a sign of mental illness. <laughs> what? <laughs> Plaid, blue and green, white. Maybe it's busy doing something else. I don't know. Here we go, we're getting some more. Oh, that's cute. Adventure awaits. These little guys are out camping. They're little, they pitched a tent and they're out camping and they're having a little sleepover outside. That's cute. Cute, cute. I think my nephews would like something like this. Because they like to go camping. Little fox print. Who likes foxes? Cute, cute. Trees. This 
is cool. This looks like a water paint, water watercolor. And there's uh, really nice blues and greens in here. I like that. And then we have the white little circles. And so that's the one little half yard bundle. A messy house is a sign of a quilter with priorities. Okay, so that was forest friends for the boys, and then here we have the forest friends for the girls. And this is a half yard bundle, five half yards plus the panel. Messy house is a sign of better things to do. That's the category that I fall under. Just saying. Clever little fox, wise little owl, sweet little rabbit, kind little deer. That's cute. It has little arrows in the middle. And then we have cost. Oh, this is cute. I like how they have these like little boys and girls. We have a little teepee and some little tossed animals. Some of them look like they might be stuffed, specifically the teddy bear. Teddy bear's cute. And that's on a pink background, light pink, very soft pink. This one is, this is, oh that's cute, a little deer in the woods. This one has a yellow background, very soft pale yellow. Very nice. A messy house is a sign a quilter lives here. Cute. Mm -hmm. I like it. We have a light circle dot. And I need to have some more pickles. Let's see. This is really cute little teepees on a little, let's see, that's kind of a, hmm, the aqua is not really aqua. Um, it's kind of a grayish aqua. You're killing me, my grand my granddaughter. She is ooing and awing. <laughs> well, and that's granddaughter. This is adorable. It really is. I need to have grandma make you a bow with this. Half yard bundle. It's sneaky. There you go. So we have a boy version and a girl version, and then the flowers. Cute. Cute, cute, and there's probably free patterns on the Free Wishes website. And then we have unicorn poop. <laughs> Is anybody listening? <laughs> <laughs> These are Tula Pink solids, and literally this bundle uh, is called unicorn poop, and Tula did it, not me. Um, but I don't think we put poop on there on our list. We just did the unicorn and then the other one's the dragons. These are all really nice soft pastels. If you have a baby quilt to make, there, here comes the last. <laughs> um, these are really nice stash builder. I love this bundle, it's so pretty. There's a couple of pinks, there's a salmon, a yellow, a couple of greens, some aquas and then blues and then purples. Wendy says that she loves unicorn poop. Um, my mom was at the grocery store a couple weeks ago and she was going down the grocery store or down the aisle and there was um, that's exactly what the hot chocolate was it was unicorn poop and the poop was of course the marshmallows and then it comes out all pink and blue and stuff and of course Emily's 14 she's like oh. <laughs> but it was, it was really funny but the boys are really enjoying it so that's good prettiest poop ever mm -hmm. I will agree with that yes Okay, so that's all we have for the new stuff. Tammy says when you come back on here because you're probably working or saving somebody's life, I do have a cross stitch chicken thing. Uh, animals cross stitch collection. It's on linen. Uh, let's see, this is in a different language. Hang on, I gotta find the French one, English one. Here we go. 12 heads, it's a 30 count. Yarn is 100% cotton as a needle in a chart, and it is chicken that looks like pancake, in case you were wondering. Very close, like there's a giant. Okay, so there's that. We'll do one more drawing for that last little bit. Um, the one that we had was a messy house is a sign of a happy quilter. I would agree with that. 
We don't have fourth giveaway. Well, we'll have to. We'll send her a surprise. Yeah. We'll send her a surprise. Okay, so Sandy Peterson, are you here? How are we doing on time, by the way? Four fifty. Ooh, perfect. So Sandy Peterson, let us know if you're here. Um, if you are, we're going to send you a surprise from one of the things that we had already in the giveaway stuff. So while she's doing that, let me tell you guys. Sandy's here. All right, so Sandy will send you a little surprise, something special from Rib Stab Stash. Thank you for being here. I am about to tell you guys the stash sale. Can we check and see if the price is where it's supposed to be? Um, let's see, so huge sale this weekend. Uh, in case you like free cuts, check your email in the morning. Uh, 5.30, wherever you live, is when you should get the email. Hmm? Cool. And then we're starting a new, uh, also a new monthly sale tomorrow because tomorrow happens to be Friday, so it's for the weekend sale, and then it's also July 1st for the July sale. So we have a huge email going out tomorrow with lots of stuff on sale. It's gonna be a really, really good, really good sale. Two sales, same time. Okay, stash sale is a small songbird rickrack. This is Lori Holtz. Small songbird is the color, rickrack. And it was um, $16.95 and it's now $10.17. So here you go. Now, Rick Rack is really fun. One of the things we were talking about, um, one of the other aprons that we saw in the Reps Fab Stashers Facebook group, um, somebody added some Rick Rack around the pockets and around the trim in here when she sewed it in and around the edge. It just kind of gave it that little extra oomph. And you can put it here. That would be cute. And it would actually match this really well, very well. Um, also, some people have used it in the binding of quilts. Um, the small one would be probably a little bit hard to put in the binding because it's really small and you want a large one for that. But the small one you could use for different embellishments, you could frame different blocks. But it's Lori Holt's Songbird Color Small Rick Rack and it's on stash sale for $10.17. We have a very limited stock of these, so if you like Rick Rack and you want to stock up, it is a good time to do that. Do that today. Sale ends at eight o'clock in the morning Pacific tomorrow. And the email is going to hit the stands here in about 20 minutes. So go in, get the stuff you saw in here from the live that you wanted, grab some Rick Rack, and we will send it out to you tomorrow. We are also working on stuffing our stash boxes. We might not be able to get them out tomorrow. Um, we were a little short staffed this week on one of the people that helps us with that. So, um, so we might not be able to get them out. We might be able to get some of them out. And then of course, Monday is the fourth. So there's no post on Monday. Um, in case any of you are Harry Potter fans, um, there is post normally, but there's no post on Sunday, but Monday there's no post either. So we probably won't have any get picked up, but we might be here shipping those. Um, let's see, and then stash sale, weekend sale, new monthly sale. Um, I wanna say a real special thanks to Mama and my sister for coming to visit during the live. And I will be home soon and we'll be able to help with dinner and finish fixing my plumbing problem. Did I tell them about the plumbing problem tell already me today? As it goes, there's, there's a leak and you know, you go into town to get a part, you go back, doesn't fit. You gotta go back into town. They don't have the right one. So then you go to another place and then they might have something that works. And so then you go back up and then you gotta have a different tool because you gotta take it off. So then you gotta go back into town again. Long story short, I was back and forth into town like six, eight times today. And that's what I did. And then I ran here. And then I'm gonna go home and snuggle my little cuties, I think, because little Bella, she's such a good mom. She's so cute. I was showing the girls the video <laughs> of her yesterday. The crazy cat lady, I can really be the crazy cat lady. <laughs> It would be very easy for me to be the crazy cat lady. I am already, I'm the crazy chicken lady. So there you go, I guess I like animals. Okay, so I'm gonna go hang out with the family. I appreciate all of you guys being here. Thank you so much. We will be back next week and we will have more fun games and lots of fun new stuff and we'll see what comes in next week. Hello and goodbye, my lovelies.